Hi everybody, welcome to a new video. In today's video, I'm going to be filming this autumn inspired makeup look. Now I'm also going to be doing a collaboration with Kasha. She is from That Curvy Nutty Diva here on YouTube and she and I have decided to create different looks for autumn. And I'm going to be linking her video down below and her channel so you guys can check her out and subscribe, show some love because she's also South African just like me which is amazing. So yeah, I decided to create this look with like very a very subtle like really smoky eye and dark like vampy lips so yeah if you guys want to see how I created this look then please keep watching so I've already done my foundation my under eye concealer and my brows off of camera I will link all the information down below if you're curious as to what I used and let's get started with the eyes okay so I'm gonna be starting off by priming my eyelids with my soft ochre paint pot by MAC Taking this matte shadow, I'm just going to be highlighting my brow bone. Okay, now going in with my Crayola eyeshadow palette, I'm going to be going in with this warm brown shade right here. Okay, now taking this color on a fluffy shader brush, I'm just going to be dusting this into my crease. Okay, now I'm going to be taking this burgundy color right here and packing this color on a dense shadow brush. I'm just going to pack this color on the outer corner of my eye, taking it into my crease. Also going back in with my blending brush to just make sure that there are no harsh lines. Okay, and then I'm going to take a little bit of this plum color right here. I'm just going to use this color just to create a little bit of depth in the crease. Okay, and then taking that same purple color on the lower lash line, I'm just going to lightly smoke it out. And then going in with that reddish shade and just blending out that purple color. Okay, and then going in with this reddish brown shade right here, and I'm going to lightly just dust this into my crease. And then going back in with my blending brush just to make sure that there are no harsh lines. Okay, so then I'm going to be taking this shade right here from my Wet n Wild Comfort Zone palette. And I'm just going to pack this on two thirds of my eye. Okay, and then just making sure that everything is nicely blended on the outer corner of the eye. Going back in with that same Wet n Wild palette, I'm going to be taking this shade right here. And I'm going to be using this to just highlight my tear ducts. Okay, and then taking my Inkblot Gel Liner, I'm going to be applying a wing. Okay, so I'm just going to be taking a reddish brown eyeliner and I'm just going to be lining my waterline. just to create a subtle, smoky effect. Okay, and then going in with mascara, I'm gonna be using my Essence Get Big Lashes Mascara. Okay, and then I'm gonna be using my Ilior Eyelashes in the number 35. Okay, and I'm just gonna go in with this liquid eyeliner to just cover the band of my false eyelash. Okay, and then to contour my face, I'm going to be taking my LA Girl Press Powder in the shade Chocolate. And I'm going to be contouring my cheeks, my forehead, my jawline. And my nose. Okay, and then I'm going to be using this blush from Rayla Cosmetics. For highlighter, I'm going to be using my Design Bronzing Brick. I'm also just going to highlight the bridge of my nose. Okay, and then for lips, I'm going to be taking my Burgundy Lip Liner and just lining my lips with this. Okay. 
Okay, and then I'm gonna be going in with Max Diva lipstick. And then lastly, I'm just gonna go in with my Alila makeup setting spray. Okay, and that is it for this look. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Please don't forget to check out Kasha's video. I will leave a link in my description bar. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to like this video, share with your friends and all that great stuff. And I'll talk to you guys very, very soon.